you go ahead and do whatever you got to do. All right, well, you can relax call. your hands. Please. You got to relax care. them so I can get to I them. I don't care about what you got to do. Who is he? He's an asshole, sir. I know that. What's his name? Hey everyone, how y'all doing? So this video is going to be controversial and I need to do some, explain a few things before we get into it. The guy you're about to see, our star name is The Armed Fisherman. That's his YouTube channel. His first name is Michael. The original video was about 42 minutes long. Basically, it takes place in 2021 and June 14th. Basically, AJ is going to go to a pier to go fishing. Nothing wrong with that. He decides to walk down the length of an entire beach by the waterline carrying an AR-15 style weapon and two GoPros as long as it's fishing poles and another pole, a big old you know, plastic uh, piping, piping poles, white ones, that has don't tread on me flag on it. He walks down there and He's not pointing at anybody, and nobody's freaking out. People are giving some support, like the flag, or talking about the Second Amendment, which is fine. A lifeguard approaches him, and he just tells this guy to go away. He tells him to, he blows him off, basically. He tells him to go away, don't bother me. The lifeguard calls the police, and the police get involved. The video picks up at that point. During this time, the pier's about a mile away from where he gets stopped. Throughout the entire confrontation, AJ is hostile confrontational, disrespectful, uncooperative, and basically you can tell by his attitude either he's a fanatic or he's an incompetent buffoon. I'm going for both. But AJ basically went out not to go fishing for fish, but for fishing for a confrontation, which he did get. Now Florida law says that you can bring a gun on the beach. Open carry. The thing is, AJ really pushed that boundary because he goes past a couple of ladies that are on the beach and he goes, if I'm just giving you any problems, let me know, I'll take care of it for you. And that's in the original 42 minute long version, I'll link that below along with the original one that I got here. AJ basically went out looking for a confrontation, he went out looking for trouble. And to the police's credit, they were very professional, very respectful, very polite. All the issues, all the attitude, all the confrontational things came from AJ. So if you do believe in the Second Amendment, that's fine, but please don't do what this idiot did. Now, Bill Fye did a video of a guy who did something similar in a park, in a wooded park, and 50 police officers swarmed him because all he got was the support of a guy on the beach, or sorry, a guy in the, in the park with a gun. Remember, we got little kids running all over the place. And nobody knows what his mind, mental state is. Of course, this guy's an idiot. But basically, the police here, gun and beach. They're going to get there fast. They're going to disarm this guy and then sort out, sort out what's going on, which is normal procedure for them. But if you do believe in the Second Amendment, what you're about to see is not how you support it. This is the worst thing you can do for the second amendment because all you're doing is adding fuel to a fire to get the amendment abolished all right so here we go whoa 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 hey 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 why you got your hands on me because you're walking to the fire i know i know i'm going fishing look i got a fishing pole Right I know, I'm going to that fishing pier right there. Okay. There's a fishing pier. Why are you, Why do you have your hands on me, ma'am? Because I'm waiting for boxes. Mick Nasty? Mick Nasty? You like a professional asshole or what? Yeah, well, I'm going to go fishing. So you can barely see the pier down in the background. It's about a mile away, as I said before. And the reason she's holding him is because she's holding one hand and his other hand's carrying that pole. 
You can't reach for that gun. She doesn't know who this guy is, doesn't know what's going on. She's playing it safe until a backup arrives. This is actually standard procedure. When they come to investigate, the first thing they're going to do is they're get that gun away from you. Then they're going to start sorting out, asking the questions, find out what's going on, who's doing what. But the first goal is to keep you from getting your hands on that gun, just in case you decide to use it. You're stopping me from going fishing. Okay. This is against the law. Sure it's not. Yeah, it is. What What is your problem? You can't be walking down. I'm walking to go fishing, ma'am. I'm going right to that fishing pier. Okay. Well, what's your problem? Excuse me, sir. What no. are you a sergeant? Who no. Who are you? Okay, what is your name, badge number? Center 9808. Yours? Detective Cap 6440. Okay. Do me a favor, let that go please, thank you. Dude, I, I, I was just going fishing. Okay. But you're not fishing right now, right? I, it's, you have to understand the law. You can't fish here. Can't I'm not fish fishing here. here. I'm relax, going, relax, I'm relax. going. Sir, you're scaring everybody walking down That's the beach. That's fine. Dude, sir, you're throwing my $300 fishing pole in the dirt right now. I'll pick it up for you. No, yeah, yeah, you're going to pay for my $300 fishing pole. So that's the lifeguard in the background. I guess that was the guy he was talking to earlier. He blew off and said, I don't want to talk to you. Go away. And $300 fishing pole. Okay. But again, you can see the pier in the background. It's almost a mile away and he's walking through the beach. And right now, again, I guess the before, the job is just to get the gun away from this guy. And then they're going to sort out who's doing what and what is and what isn't going on. I am not fishing here. I am going fishing to the fishing pier that is where I'm, I haven't fished. I haven't thrown a fishing pole. I haven't done anything. You want to go up to the, uh, we need to no, up there. Come on, sir. we're not, I'm not breaking the law. I'm not breaking the law. Do you think it's appropriate walking yes, around? Yes, absolutely. With an AR-15 on your absolutely. chest? Absolutely. Where there's children and everybody on absolutely. the beach? Absolutely, yes. How stupid are you? <laughs> yes. And that is the main problem with the Second Amendment nuts. Supporting the Second Amendment is one thing, but doing what he's doing is just pure irresponsibility. Again, he's doing this to make a YouTube video. He's not going to go fishing. He's here specifically for what's happening right now. He wants a confrontation for a YouTube video. This is what's going on. You don't think that's going to cause problems? I get people might call. How do we go up there? No, I don't want to go call. Things. I. 901-151, what law did I break? What Let's law did, there. no. What law did I break? What law did I break? Listen, this city ordinance is... I didn't fish here. Okay. I'm going to the fishing pier right there. You walk the entire beach to go to the fishing I pier? I can walk it's any, right it's, going to, it's going to, it's going to... Much more accessible. It's going to and returning from. It doesn't matter where I am trying to go fishing. It's about going to and returning from. Okay. I can walk anywhere I want to go trying to go fishing. And I'm literally telling you, I am going to... Dude, you don't have to fucking hold my right. hand like relax. I'm a fucking criminal. Relax. Just relax. I haven't okay. done... Look, my guy, you got a gun strapped to your chest. Like I get it, beach, And that's why we're doing what we're doing, so relax. Because I'm not... Relax. Just Did you swear an oath to the Constitution? Oh, God, here we go. Uh, then what, what's the problem? What's the problem? What's the problem with you? What's the problem? What's the problem with you guys defending your oath? So he has two GoPros on him, which means he is not out here to go fishing. He's here specifically for a copy of what he got. And then there you can see the weapon. It looks like an AR-15. It looks like an assault rifle, third-round magazine. And there's a point where, why would you need one of these to go fishing? What are you doing? Are you hunting Jaws? Is, that, is there Godzilla circling the pier? Why do you need a gun to go fishing? Seriously. This is, again, this is strictly for YouTube. There's no fishing. There's no Second Amendment audit. This is him pushing for a confrontation, which he got. To the Constitution of Florida, Florida, and the United States. What's the problem? Can I, am I lawfully allowed to do what I'm doing? Am I lawfully allowed? I don't care. Am I lawfully allowed to do it? I don't have to listen. Am I lawfully allowed to do what I'm doing? Yes or no? Am I, am I lawfully allowed to do what I'm doing? Alright, hold on. What's your name? What's your name? Okay, listen. Am I lawfully... Am I lawfully... Listen to us. Just give us a few moments. I don't need to listen. 
Am I lawfully allowed to do what I'm doing? Okay, well, you're going fishing, right? Yes, I'm going to do that. What do you need an AR-15? Watch out fishing. You don't need to know why. You don't need to know a reason. Can you give me a reasonable answer for that? Yes, I've almost been robbed while I've been fishing. You've almost been robbed while trying to fish. Okay, so you need an AR-15 type weapon to go fishing. Okay, because you're afraid someone's going to rob you and take your fish, your fishing pole? No, that's boneheadedly stupid. I need, an AR I need whatever I need to protect my fish. Okay. Just being detained, you're not under arrest. Alright. Just give us a few more. Just what law did I break? We're gonna okay. get to the of that, what okay? what law did Can you I stop break? For me just for the no. last minute? Do you have body cams? I do. Right. Okay. okay. Is okay. it running? Yes, it is. Okay. Right. What law did I break? Just what relax. law did I break? Am I allowed to go fishing while hunting, fishing, or camping? Yes or no, sir? Yes or no? You seem to know it pretty well. I know it. Okay. I do so this across the state of. I know this. I'm going fishing to that fishing tree. Don't. Why am I in here, though? Why are you taking my phone? I don't consent to any search or seizing. You're not being searched, but I'm going to take your weapon from my You're seizing my... You're... My... My... My safety is paramount to you. Relax. Relax. You are in the safest place right now. No, I'm not. No, you're not protecting You're restricting me from my rights. Call your state attorney. State attorney. Call your state attorney and see if they want to cross no, quick, a I guy was walking one. to go fish. Okay. I am walking to that fishing pier right now. Right. That's where I am going. Yeah. Okay, so at this point, you are a piece of sh**. So in the original 42 minute long video, he's basically going walking past people and he sees some people and goes, If anybody gives you any problems, you let me know, I'll take care of it for you. And that could be interpreted as him out there looking for trouble. And his activity, his attitude, he's trying to escalate this. He wants to escalate this even more. He wants more physicality in this confrontation. You can tell that right now. His attitude, his manners, the way he's, his body language, he wants an escalation to get more YouTube views. That's the, basically the point of all this. Oh, yeah. yeah, I got it. Think outside the box. Hey, did you swear an oath to the Constitution? I did. You're a piece of then. Did you serve, sir? Don't worry about if I served. I you did. guys, I did. you guys, you guys, why don't you just use the QD mount, dude? Just use the QD mount, because I got to... Can you relax? Thank you. What's your name? Don't worry about what my name okay, is. Okay, well, I was just going to ask if you could just hang out with us for a little bit. I don't want to hang out with you. I want to go fishing. That's all I want to do is go fishing. You guys, don't mess with my... Dude, you're pointing my gun in my direction, sir. And there's one chambered in there. <laughs> Whatever, dude. You never need to point a firearm at somebody. I, I'm trying to call my lawyer. Okay. If you're trying to throw me in a car, I'll, at least let me call my lawyer. Yeah, we can get that. Just sit down. Hey sir. Out, hey sir. Okay. So, will you identify yourself to us? I don't have to. Will you have to identify? I am going to a fishing pier where my fishing license is covered under that fishing pier. Okay, I understand. And and I listen, you're not. Li listen, you're you're not wrong. I know I'm not. Okay. So How, where are we at? However, where are we at? I'm trying, I'm, to going to a I'm trying to explain. I'm trying to explain to you. I'm covered under the law. I do. I'm trying, 901 151. I'm, I'm aware of what it is. 901 151. What crime did I commit? However, I'm trying to explain. One. Are you going to let me talk? Nope. nope. This guy is stupid. So again, he's trying to escalate this into a confrontation, into a confrontation. The police have been very professional, very respectful. This is the guy with the attitude. He's causing his prob own problems. If he just stop being so confrontational, he could be out of that car in less than five minutes. He's not. Again, he's trying to escalate this. He wants a bigger video for more YouTube ride revenue, for more views and more clicks. In the end, that's what this is all about. And the police officers, to their credit, are being very respectful, very professional. 
and all the problems he's having are on he calls him from him. Let me out of this car, give me my we, stuff back. We have to verify that you're not a convicted uh, felon. You don't the the government is the federal case law has already proven okay. that I do not need so, to prove myself until I've committed a are crime. You, are you refusing to identify yourself? I'm not refusing anything. Right okay. now I am not breaking the wall. Okay, so are you gonna tell me who I you are? Not gonna, I am not breaking the wall. I've already contacted okay. my lawyer. Okay, that's fine. Okay, we, we've so established that. So you're going to a phone call and saying, hey, release this guy. Okay, are, are you going to identify yourself to us? I, under, what law did I break? Okay. What you're detained, law did I, you're, what law did I hear break? me out. You're detained because you're walking around What him. law did I break? I'm trying to explain to you. you what you're, law? You're temporarily detained. What law? Okay. What law? What gonna, law? Are you going to identify yourself? What law did I break? And I will identify myself. So, like Monday, June 14, 2021. This is him doing hours this. And zero five seconds. Clearwater Police, this is Owen. The line is recorded. Uh, how you doing, Owen? I was just wondering, is it your department's policy to uh, arrest people when they're legally fishing and open carrying legally in the state of Florida and violate their constitutional rights? Give me one second, okay? Okay. I'm just a dispatcher. Give me one second. Let me get you in touch with somebody. All right. Thank you. All right, sir. What's your first name? Uh, good citizen is my name. I'm sorry? Good citizen is my name. Good citizen? Yes, sir. Okay. What's a good phone number right for behind you? Your, right behind your police department. Uh, a, a gentleman's constitutional rights are being violated. He's in the back of a police car. He was just going fishing. And the only time you can open carry in the state of Florida is if you're going fishing okay, or what's, you're camping. Okay, what's a good phone number so I can have somebody give you a call back? That's okay. I'll just call the Justice Department because his constitutional rights are being violated. Okay. What's your name again, Owen? My name's Owen, yep. And this is a recorded line, right, Owen? Yes. All right, thank you. Okay. So, I had to say that was probably AJ calling the police. And he was doing it in the police car that he wasn't calling his lawyer. He was calling the police. As for this more conspiring, I don't know. He could have done himself. These idiots have a habit of screwing around, editing and re-editing their videos to make them like they're the victims and they're the heroes where the police are the bad guys. So, until we get an actual copy of the body cam footage of this, I'm taking what he says from a huge grain of salt. We've already seen his attitude and his lack of respect toward everything really you can be discussing whether it's a, discussing whether they have grounds to hold him again you could be discussing his attitude maybe they dealt with him before but basically we just don't know because his word his credibility is in question even in his own video so let's see what's going on clearwater police this is owen the line is reported yeah you guys uh just handcuffed uh, somebody that was legally uh, open carrying while going fishing and he's in the back of one of your cruisers right now and I think you better call the chief and tell him to release that guy because the lawsuit ain't gonna be pretty man you know what I'm saying uh, yeah your, your officer really screwed up so uh, you know I like suggest you release that person because the lawyers I'm sure they're calling or whatever so uh yeah. So again, this could be one of his friends. I don't think that this is his lawyer. I don't think I mean, this might actually be him using a fake changing his voice around. But again, you don't call nine one one dispatch for something this stupid. It itself is a crime. So it's definitely not a lawyer because he would not lawyer would not be calling dispatchers. He'd be calling. You'd be waiting. He got to wherever he got to. He would not be calling dispatch, telling him to release this guy. So it's probably either one of his friends, or it could be AJ using a different voice, but definitely not a lawyer, and definitely not somebody on the beach calling about this. That's all okay, I what got, is, but... What is your first name? My first... And I'm calling from Daytona Beach. You're calling from Daytona Beach? That's right, because he's live on YouTube right now. You guys just arrested him. He's in the back of a cruiser, illegally open carrying while fishing. So, uh... Okay, do you have a good phone number? I can have somebody give you a call if that's working this. Mm -hmm. Uh, my phone number? Yeah. 
is that? What's your last And the guy you have arrested, his name is uh, Michael Taylor. He was an open carry activist in Florida. So just try to get a hold of that officer and get him out of handcuffs before there's any. Okay, what was your last name again, Derek? I'm sorry, I missed it. Uh, oh. Hi, Michael, you ready? Yeah, I'm, I've been ready. Yeah. Um, what's your name and badge number? I'm in Daytona oh, Beach watching this uh, live yeah, stream, and you guys oh, should not put him in cuffs. Okay. I will let them know how the they give you a call back, okay? Yeah. Yeah, I appreciate it. Right, yeah, yeah. USA. Okay. And your badge number? It's 6790. Perfect. And yours? Do you want? Oh, you're taking my handcuffs off. Well, hey, What's your name? You gotta put your, you gotta relax your, and spell your name. D-R-U-M-M-O-N-D. You gotta relax your hands. You want me to take? You can go ahead and do whatever you gotta do. All right, well, you can relax your hands. You gotta relax them so I can get to them. I don't care about what you gotta do. All right. What was your badge number? I'm sorry. So. Yeah, uh, so the Tunnel Beach calling dispatch over this is a crime. But this, that itself is a crime. This idiot just, he went here for a YouTube video and it's 42 minutes long the original, but as you can see, he wasn't going fishing, obviously. Zero eight. Thank you. And hey, what was your name? Four. Uh, and uh, how do you spell it? How do you spell it? M O O R E, just right here. Uh, yeah, don't don't point to it because is that what you're going to tell the judge? Yes. All right, perfect. My name, relax. Your badge number? Can you relax so you can get the Shut up. Here? Shut up. Hey, Michael, What's you your want me to explain number? to you Seven what happened nine, today? Your name and badge number? Michael. Michael, we're trying to get the handcuffs off. I'm trying to get the handcuffs off so you can go, okay, man. Take the handcuffs off. Do you want me to explain to you why you were I stopped today? I don't want an explanation because okay. you guys are all a bunch of tyrants. What we're dealing with here is a complete lack of respect for the law. Did you swear okay. an oath to the Constitution and the Florida Constitution of Florida? Do you want me to explain Did you why swear you an today? oath to the Florida Constitution Michael. and the state laws that we have here? Michael, you did want, you swear I, an I'm oath? I'm done talking to you, Michael. Can okay, you please grab your items off my vehicle? I, I just want to, I'm taking my guns, I'm going to reload them. Can hey I everybody, I'm, a re I'm reloading my guns. Shut up. I'm going to reload my guns. If you guys want to walk away while I reload my fire. Well, you're on my vehicle, Michael, so I can't tell. Dude, you guys took my sling off, dude. Are you kidding me? All you had to do was Michael. take the QD off my... Michael, you're you a dumb shit. That. You're a dumb shit. You're a dumb shit. And you're a dumb shit. Alright. After this, you guys can kick the rocks because I gotta fix my... Please don't point it at me now. I'm not pointing my I gun know. at you. It's pointing at the ground. I know. Guns have their uses. Idiots with guns make me nervous. You guys are all pieces of shit. Michael, are you all going shut the going up? fishing now? I'm go I was on my way to fishing, right. dumb shit. Don't forget your fishing. Shut the up. Let me tell you something, folks. You can't fix stupid. I'm going to just kill it right there. It's just him cussing and swimming rest of the way. Uh, yeah, but it just takes you to listen. Like, if you do a Second Amendment audit, this is the worst way to do it. You're walking down a beach full of kids with a gun. And as you can see, this guy is confrontational from the beginning. It's strictly a YouTube fish, and he got up and he got something. Ultimately, we're seeing that the problem was on his end. He came out looking for trouble, he got trouble, and he's just a bit of a complete jerk. Alright guys, you take care of yourselves, and I'll see you when I see you.